Hi and welcome to Play Tutorials. Today is going to be all about zones. It's an introduction to zones. It's a how does zones work? What do they do for you? And how can I calculate the sizes of my zones? So first of all, what what is zones? Well, zones are multiple playlists. So for example, if you want different content playing on the left side as the right side, then you have two zones and they will work independently. So to show that, I have a master playlist here where I've added three sub playlists. And please make note that zones, well, one zone is one playlist, one playlist is one zone. So let's preview this one and just look at it while the, the presentation is displayed on the screen. So as you can see, on the left side, top, is my playlist called Content. And it simply slides photos or images, uh, fades them in, fades them out every uh, 30 seconds. On the right side, uh, this is what I call my right column. I have a mix of the weather, a weather forecast and my Facebook photo in the bottom, which is the full width of the screen. I have a logo, a bit of information and then in, in the, the right corner it's switching between the date and the time. And these are three independent playlists doing their stuff. So let's go back. So we're back at the editor and we're looking at my master playlist. I am not going to show you how to create playlists or sub playlists and zones and stuff like that because we already have a video on this. Um, this is only for explanation on the more technical stuff. So let's move out of this one and into a simple spreadsheet. For those of you who, who have been working with Play for a while, you know that when you create playlists, they are usually defined by an aspect ratio. Uh, usually a 16-9 or 9-16 or whatever. When you're working with zones and sub-playlists, you only work with resolution. You can't use aspect ratio. Resolution, well, what I like to do is take a look in the, the specifications for my TV and figure out how big is my resolution. And let's just say the resolution is a full HD resolution. Well, then you have 1920 pixels in the width and 1080 pixels in the height. What I'm going to be showing you in a second is how you calculate these sub playlist sub zones. Um, what I want is, is the scenario down here where I have, just as you saw in the preview, a content, a right, and a footer. So, in fact, there are multiple ways of doing this. You know, you can grab a piece of paper and a pen draw it, measure it out by inches, centimeters. You can do calculations on percentage. It's, it really doesn't matter because there isn't a wrong way or a right way. The way that I like to do it is in a spreadsheet. So one cell, one cell in here is the same as 10 pixels. So I've added 192 cells in the width and I've added 108 cells in the height, which gives me the resolution of my master, full HD 1920 times 1080. So what I need to figure out is how big is my content, how big is my right, and how big is my footer in, of course, again, in pixels, one cell, 10 pixels. So let's 
just mask this up. This is what I like to do. Um, usually I give it some color just to see how it looks on my my canvas and I think this is what I want so let's just go ahead and and do a couple of calculations so the footer which is the red area well it has of course 192 because it's full width so my width on the footer is 1920 the height on my footer is 20 cells that's 200 the right my width is 60 that's 60 oh sorry 600 my height is 88 that's 880 my content is 132 adding a zero and my height well 88 and adding a zero so this is a visual way of doing it it gives me the opportunity to see how does how how is this going to look and when i'm satisfied with how it's looking then it's very easy for me to calculate the width and the height of all of my zones and as you can see the playlists that i was using previous which were content the right and the footer well they have exactly the same numbers as what i just calculated so my master is 16.9 you can keep the aspect ratio on that or you can go with resolution but for the rest of your playlists all your sub playlists you have to put in the the full resolution that's it for now you know where to find us if you have any questions thank you